Well, with the school year winding down, it's not uncommon for students to pull off big pranks before graduation, but it appears things went a little too far at one North York Catholic High School today. Several students entered Senator O'Connor College School early this morning and covered stairs, floors, and door handles with peanut butter and cooking oil. Now, this was no laughing matter for one parent whose daughter suffers from severe nut allergies. When someone does an intentional act of putting peanut butter, that threatens their lives. Mm -hmm. That's wrong. Mm -hmm. That's an intentional act to hurt people. People with allergies have to deal with that every day, safety issues. Mm -hmm. they, and this puts them in peril. You know, you can't go into a school. You're supposed to think that you're safe. And, you know, we do what we can with allergies. That's what life is all about. We're not asking people to stop using peanut butter. We're just asking people to have some compassion and empathy and have some understanding and create some awareness. To say bluntly is kind of stupid because it's literally life and death. And I think for some people that's really hard to comprehend that the fact that, oh, they won't be there anymore because I put peanut butter on that door handles. Now, grade 11 and 12 students were sent home for the day. Cleaning crews acted quickly and disinfected part of the school, allowing classes to continue for grades 9 and 10. The school should fully reopen tomorrow, but not before it receives a thorough washdown. We want to make sure that any evidence of uh, or trace amounts of peanut butter are, are removed, as it can be potentially life-threatening for those with uh, an allergy to peanut butter. There's no word yet if students involved will be punished. Peanut butter products aren't banned at Toronto Catholic schools, but the board says it does have policies in place to protect students with severe allergies. And a City News viewer called us this morning and told us about the situation at Senator O'Connor. If you've got a news tip, here are the ways you can get in touch with us.